Creating and developing a brand is not a one-off thing. It is something that evolves and grows for as long as your business is trading. A successful brand requires monitoring, maintenance, attention and value so that the customer will remain loyal to your brand, but how is this achieved? The following list of things you should and shouldn't do when creating a new brand will set you off along the path of success. 1. Don't look at your competitors. You may think that this is something you should do but in spending time looking at your competitors, you will not be focused on what your brand is all about. You are not your competitor, you are unique and you started out in business because you wanted to be better than them. 2. To create a brand that begins from within, remember how everyone told you to be yourself and not to copy others? Well this is true in the world of business. Therefore, you need to build your brand from within and build it around you. Ask yourself who you are as a brand, what makes you different and what can you become? Only you can answer these questions. 3. Don't give your customers something they want to hear just for the sake of it. Many business commit too much when promoting their brand. This may sound fine but in reality, this is what will make you blend in with other brands that you are competing with. Of course, you are going to have to big up certain aspects of your brand because of customer expectations, however, when you are defining your USPs, offer them in a way that communicates exactly why you are different because this will result in people wanting to experience your brand a lot faster. 4. Do support the USPs that you create, you can make as many claims as you want, quality, service and even lead times but whatever you promise, ensure that you can back it up. You will also be required to create a culture that believes in your promises. If you over-promise and under-deliver this will only lead to disappointment. 5. Don't focus too much on your tagline. Spending too much time on your tagline doesn't mean that it will be a success or change the way in which your clients think. 6. Do work on a tagline that says exactly who you are. Once you have defined your brand you will then be able to create a tagline that works. Your tagline has to be straight to the point and so it needs to be created with conviction and strength. 7. Don't assume that your employees will support your brand, even after a successful brand launch. Spending a lot of money on a brand launch hat is both inspirational and motivating is great but all of that will soon disappear with your employees. 8. Do involve everyone prior to your brand launch. A launch should create a buzz around the place because it is the start of something new and exciting. To be a successful brand you will need your employees to work with you. Once the dust has settled following the launch of your brand, implement a strategy that has been created to build a culture that encompasses everything your brand is about. 9. Don't promise staff the earth. If you make lots of promises to staff then you could be setting yourself up for a fall because if you fail to deliver it will seriously affect the morale of your staff. You will quickly lose respect and that will mean that your brand will suffer as a consequence. Tender commit to your promises, what more can be said other than, if you make promises, you need to stick to them. There are many ways in which you can build and grow a brand but remaining true to the fundamentals of what defines success and failures will ensure that your brand succeeds. Hassan Almodalala Digital Consultant REESHKSA.com